Bowl Sunday, February the 3rd, 2008, at stake the Vince Lombardi Trophy. Gentlemen, away we go. What are you dreaming about all your life? We're here now. I know we all want it. I know we all want it. Let's do what it takes to get it. It's our last time being here together. Don't take it for granted. Go out there and make plays. The Patriots weren't just playing for a championship. They were making a run at history. One win from becoming the first team to ever go 19-0. A perfect season. This O-line we're facing today is the greatest O-line of all time. Their quarterback cannot be sacked. Can he be hit? We don't stand a chance. The question is fear versus faith. And I believe that this giant team has faith in their hearts, they think they can win this game. There's a quiet confidence about this team. I don't think they're going to be overwhelmed by the moment. Play loose, play fast, play hard, play smart, play for each other. And I guarantee you, we will win this. The New York Wolves, everybody talk about a dynasty. Our dynasty starts today. There's a certain look a defiant team has. Loose, exuberant. Fearless. The Giants an improbable ride. They've won three in a row. They're 13 and six on the season. The New England Patriots trying to rewrite history. 18 and 0. For the Patriots, immortality was but a victory away. But history is not destiny. For a season to be truly perfect, it should also have a perfect ending. For 60 minutes of football. He guaranteed. For fans, sometimes faith can be enough. Come kickoff, the Giants relied on something a little more tangible muscle. And Super Bowl 42 is underway. The Giants opened the game with brutal simplicity, power running. The Giants can execute a root canal on this uh, Patriots defense. Bradshaw runs right. He's got the first down inside the 35. Carrying Patriots inside the 30. And the kid Bradshaw showing feistiness. It's starting to feel like smash mouth football from this offense, Bob. It's not all finesse, Dick. It is no run, but we're going to continue to punch you in the mouth and we'll pass when we want to. Why not? They had the matchup to do it. Number 17, Plexico Burris, was proving too big and too strong. Eli Manning, too poised. Giants opening possession consumed 9 minutes 59 seconds, the longest drive in Super Bowl history. Kick on its way, hand over end, and it is good. New York had the lead, but no margin for error. The Patriots simply don't scare, and they don't miss opportunities. Coming down to Maroney at the 1. That's left to the 5, to the 10, to the 15. Wheeling outside to the 20, 25, 30, 35. He's to the 40, to the 45-yard line. Lawrence Maroney in a bang-bang kickoff return. Lawrence Maroney gave the Patriots good field position. But New England moves best through the air. Fires over the middle. It's caught inside the 40-yard line and down to about the giant 36. First down across the 30-yard line to the New York Giant 28. Wes Welker. Let's go! Go green! Even if a team knows what's coming, stopping the Patriots' passing game is no sure thing. With so many options to defend against, 
Eventually, a coverage fails. The end zone. Cole caught. Touchdown. No, he dropped it. Flag. But a penalty flag is down as Ben Watson tried to make the catch in the back of the end zone. Had a linebacker, I believe it was Pierce. Antonio Pierce, all over him. Quintessential Patriots. Find a matchup and exploit. Few linebackers can run with Ben Watson. The penalty put the ball on the one-yard line. Three tight ends for the Patriots. Second down and goal to go. Maroney right side. In. Touchdown. Lawrence Maroney. So the Patriots with a good kickoff return from Lawrence Maroney. Bringing it out to the 44-yard line. And then they capped it off with a Lawrence Maroney touchdown. We got the jitterbugs out. I said, let's go. All right, let's go. The start of the second quarter saw the Giants trailing, but what no one had seen in New York's marvelous postseason run were mistakes. That began to change on New York's next possession. Direct snap to Manny. He steps, he fires left. It is intercepted. Picked off. Ellis Hodge. Giants are making mistakes that are going to cost you against the Patriots. First interception thrown by Manning in the postseason. The errors kept coming. But the Patriots couldn't capitalize. Fumbles the football, it's loose, batted away again, still loose, and Smith recovers it for a first down at the 20 yard line. You have to play perfect to beat the perfect team. Draw play, Bradshaw. Fumbles the football, recovered by the Patriots at the 30 yard line. No signal yet, but I think the Patriots have it. Manning signaling, they still have it. Well, there's a giant at the bottom. That ball may have been Milford underneath that pile. Oh, my. Yeah, Bradshaw stole it back. He got it back. The Giants recovered it. Lucky. I thought the Patriots had themselves a fumble recovery deep in Giant territory. When we pressure and someone's there, you gotta beat them. You just gotta beat them. Someone's gonna beat them. You gotta beat them. Beating the man in front of you sounds simple enough, but the Patriots were being outsmarted. Tom Brady's audibles weren't fooling the Giants, who were getting pressure on just about every pass attempt. Move, 20 Brady took another hit. It wasn't just poor pass protection. The Giants' defensive coaches had deciphered some of Tom Brady's signals. Listen, it's going to be sent to the back unless AP changes it. If Brady changes the protection, okay, then we're going to be ready to change the blitz. With Brady's adjustments a non-factor, the Giants' ultra-athletic defensive ends were able to generate tremendous pressure. Steps up, he's going to be sacked again. Three Giant defensive linemen were in on Tom Brady. But it was actually linebacker Kavika Mitchell who keyed the play. What a play by Kavika Mitchell, Bob. He lined up over center, fakes like he's going away, gets the center to turn, and right up the gut. That's where Brady does not want to see pressure. Every blitz seemed to work, and with no time to throw, Brady's passes were off target. His most potent weapons reduced to bystanders. And the Giants front four just doing a magnificent job so far against the Patriots passing game. No way! Hey, Jeff Walker, you keep me relentless! Relentless front! Relentless front! The Patriots' last play of the first half epitomized their trouble. Brady back, has time, steps up, gets hit, fumble. fumble the football, it's loose on the ground, they scramble for it. Who has it? Giant ball in midfield. Third sack of Brady. With 10 seconds to go in the half, Human Your recovered it. For 18 games, the league's MVP had been all but untouched and unchallenged. Now Tom Brady and the Patriots were in jeopardy of being undone. At the half, the Patriots had the lead, but not their swagger. More important, they didn't seem to have an answer for the Giants' pass rush. If they were going to complete the perfect season, they'd have to find one in the season's final 30 minutes. Hey, here we go. It comes down to right now. Right now. There's a look winners wear. As the second half began, the Giants had it. Jack 
Brady! And they had the Patriots' blocking scheme figured out. Shots in the pocket. He's sacked by Michael Strahan. Old man Strahan having a ball out there. Old man Strahan ball. Fourth sack of the game of Brady. The Giants hadn't scored since their opening drive. Eli Manning knew that had to change, and he knew how to make it happen. Giants have 80 yards to go to try to take the lead. Manning back to throw. Sets, looks over the middle. Boss makes the catch on the run. Still on speed across the field. To the 40, to the 35, and knocked down at the 34-yard line. Kevin Boss. 46 yards, the longest catch of his rookie season. Those are the unsung heroes, the unusual suspects that can make a play in this game because they're going to give the big guys attention. So the Giants are marching, and the Patriots are giving ground. And they're reeling a little bit. Yes, they are. Tyree in motion, handoff, bump, play fake, manning the throw to the end zone, touchdown! David Tyree on the post, and the Giants have the lead with 11 to go in the ball game. This quarterback, Eli Manning, this drive, he orchestrated like a captain. He made all the right moves and the right decisions. 80-yard drive, six plays, Tyree a five-yard touchdown catch. The touchdown pass was perfect, and a perfect example of what arm strength can do. Any less velocity, and Eli Manning's pass would have been incomplete, or worse. Instead, the Giants had a lead deep in Super Bowl 42. 11.05 to go in the ballgame. Giants 10, Patriots 7. The Patriots were in trouble. They not only trailed, but unable to contain the Giants' pass rush, Tom Brady was unable to find a rhythm or his receivers. The Patriots in grave danger of seeing their undefeated season go up in smoke. The Giants had a chance to seal victory on their next possession. Handing over center. Back to throw. Under pressure. Rolls left. The boy is going to run. Now lobs it downfield for Burrow, who can't make a diving catch. Oh, he had him wide open. And he overthrew him by a hand. What a try there, though. You know, it's just good sense of awareness by the quarterback avoiding and eluding. Threw the lob up there, and Burrow couldn't get He let it just a touch too much. It was an opportunity lost, and the Giants knew it. We get the ball. We got to do something with it. This next drive coming up is going to get For the Patriots, the moment of truth had arrived. The perfect season lay in the balance. Time for the greats to be great. minutes left in the game. Brady in the shotgun, takes the snap, fires over the middle, caught by Randy Moss across the 30 for the first down. In motion from right to left, Welker back to throw Brady, looking, fires over the middle, caught by Welker, first down at midfield. Brady stands in, stands in, over the middle, it goes, complete inside the 10. And another first down, first and goal to go to Kevin Falk. Patriots with their own version of a root canal. Third and goal at the six. Direct snap to Brady, looks, fires, touchdown! Randy Moss! Tom Brady rifles a six-yard touchdown pass to Randy Moss with 2.42 to go. And the Patriots regain the lead. Drive started at the 20, all the way downfield he came, mostly via the pass. Corey Webster fell down, and he left Randy Moss all alone. The Patriots have a four-point lead with 2.42 to go in the game, so Brady does what he had to do, and now the defense will have to do what they have to do. 
2.42 to go. Patriots have the lead, 14-10. The Giants know what they have to do. They've got to go 83 yards in 2.39. They've got three timeouts in the two-minute warrants. weren't perfect, but they weren't looking for perfection, just a win. The Patriots, looking for both, were in danger of finding neither. Every drive has a turning point. Super Bowl 42 was about to see not just its defining moment, but a play for the ages. Third and five from their own 44. And he takes the snap. Back to throw. Under pressure. Avoids the rush. And he's going to fight out of it. Still fights out of it. Now throws it deep downfield. Wide open Tyree who makes the catch. How in the world did he do that? What a play by Manning. He eluded three sacks. And what a catch by Tyree. 58 seconds to go. They had Manny this. by the back of the shirt, and he was able to evade that and get away from it. How did he get away from that? I have no idea. I thought they had him sacked for sure. I am still flabbergasted, and it's amazing how he didn't go down. What a job he did. Tyree had Harrison all over him. The ball was on his helmet, but he got his other hand on it, pulled it in. What a catch he made with the coverage that was on top of him. He held it all the way down. It was the greatest play in Super Bowl history. This game. There's no quit in this team. There's no die in this team. So now the Giants are in a position to win the game. You've got a stomach for high drama and intrigue. This is it. And Eli Manning and the Giants. And perfection. And don't forget, Burris, he's been able to get behind these fellows. Three receivers right, Burris left. 39 seconds to go. Giants down by four. Manning calling signals, takes the snap, looks left, pops it up. Burris is wide open, touchdown Giants! And the left corner of the end zone! Touchdown! With 35 seconds to go, the Giants regain the lead! 35 seconds remaining in the game. The Giants have taken the lead. And the Patriots' perfect season is only 35 seconds away from ending. seconds left to play things do not look good for the Patriots the Giants had the lead and the inside track to history but the Patriots had Tom Brady let's see if Tom Brady could do it one more time 
16. One more play for New England. Brady takes the snap. Back to pass. Steps up. Heaves one deep down the left sideline again. In coverage, and it's knocked away. And that is it. As Tom Coughlin gets a Gatorade pass. The Patriots will not be perfect. They were for 18 games, but not the 19. Perfection does not come easy. Losses do not come harder. And the Giants with the most improbable win in recent memory have won Super Bowl 42. And let the celebration begin. Having summoned a strength no one knew they had, the Giants reveled with a tenderness no one could miss. Emotions run deep when the stakes are high, even for the game's MVP, who had been so calm, so cool, in the biggest game of his career. For coach Tom Coughlin and the Giants, the season wasn't perfect, but it did have the perfect ending. And with it came the perfect title, World Champions. He lied to his critics, how you like me now. 